Well, Habitat for Humanity is getting a boost for some big country music stars this morning. Fox 2's Amy Andrews is live with an exclusive. Hey guys, I'm hanging out here with the hottest country duo in the world right now, Florida Georgia Line. And for some reason, they're in Metro Detroit building a house as we speak. You guys have two concerts this weekend here at the Palace, but you're dedicating your time to Habitat for Humanity. This is Brian and Tyler. Tell us why you're out here. I know you've got a big show tonight. Yeah, well, the song Dirt uh, that we recorded, our first single off the record, too, really ch really changed our life. And, uh, you know, it's a song that's so special to us, and it's real to us, and it's real to a lot of other people. And, and it's great to be able to show that, to see people living that out. And we've always wanted to be bigger than the music, and for, for us to be able to give back, it means the world to us. Our fathers gave great examples of how to work and be uh, an example in and out of your community and that's what we're trying to do. The woman you're building a house for is an army veteran, a single mother of three. That is just someone who deserves a home like this, Tyler. Absolutely, you know, and that's uh, that's why we're big fans of Habitat for Humanity and all the people that they help out, man. We've gotten to be a part of three or four of these builds so far and uh, it's amazing to meet the families, see, see the lives that are being changed out here and, uh, you know, it's an honor for us to get to be out here and be a part of this. You guys have won so many awards for your hit cruise and you mentioned Dirt and you have a new album coming out on the 14th. Tell us about that and what we can expect. Yeah, it's called Anything Goes and you know for us we just realized over the past couple years and basically ever since we met the way we write, the way we do our shows and run our tour and kind of run our thing that we do is Anything Goes, you know. Uh, with the songs our influences are kind of all over the map. We're country to the core but you know we like to keep things fresh and switch it up and on tour we like to make it loud, lights, and uh, and maybe a little fireball here and there. So you never know what can happen. I hear you guys are also hosting the first uh, country awards show on Fox coming up in December. We are. Uh, we are. We're very excited about that. That's something that we've uh, always thought would be fun to do. And uh, now that we're a little bit more uh, used to going to these award shows and things, <laughs> it's, it's going to be fun to bring our flavor and, and host one. And, uh, you know, we'll see what happens. We're excited. Yeah, you're excited about being in Detroit. What, what's your favorite part of being here in this part of the country? Have you have you been to Detroit much? A little bit, actually. Yeah. Um, the most amazing thing over here to us is is the fans. I mean, that's what keeps us coming back. The landscape's beautiful, but uh, the passion that our fans show. I mean, it just seems to grow and grow and get better and louder every time we come back. So much love. Shout out to our fans. It's uh, it's incredible. I'm gonna let you two get back to work because there's a wonderful woman who needs her house finished. But it was so nice right. to meet you. Thank you for your time and have Anytime. fun at the Palace tonight and tomorrow, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Good to see you. All right, we are gonna hear from the woman who is the proud recipient of this Habitat home coming up at 11. Reporting live from the Clarkston area, Amy Andrews, Fox 2 News.